One of the best ways to decorate a cake is to put a picture on it. Not only is it cool and clever, but it makes the cake distinct. There will be no second guessing whose special occasion it is when their face is plastered all over the cake. Whether you want to put a picture on a cake for a birthday, graduation, anniversary, or another event, you're likely wondering how to do it. After all, regular photographs aren't exactly edible. So, how's it done? There are a few options. The most popular choice is to print a picture on a specialty printer using edible paper and ink. However, you can also lay a photo wrapped in plastic on top of the cake or trace it using wax paper and icing. Hello. I'm Tracy Adams, and I've been baking for years. One of my favorite things to do is put pictures on cakes. It's just so cute. And today, I'm here to show you how it's done. Let's put a picture on a cake. How to put a picture onto a cake three ways. Did you know there are three successful ways to put a picture on a cake? And the best part is that all of the methods are relatively simple. Even newbie bakers won't have trouble translating an image onto a cake. Method 1, Edible Paper and Ink Did you know that you can print a picture that's 100% edible? It might sound like some kind of new age phenomenon. But it's all too real. All you need is a specialty printer that can print edible pictures, the same found in most bakeries that make picture cakes. Once you have your printer, simply do the following. Step 1, select your digital image in JPEG format. If you're using a physical photo, you will need to scan it and save it as a JPEG document. Step 2, print using edible paper and ink. There are several options, including wafer paper and frosting sheets. Don't forget the edible ink, too. The last thing you want is to whip up a toxic cake. Step 3, allow the picture to dry for 5 minutes. This will give the ink time to soak into the paper, creating a vibrant image. Step 4, cut the borders, if desired. If your photo has a little extra, go ahead and use your kitchen scissors to cut off the excess. Step 5, place the image onto the cake. It's that simple and looks great. Note, if you do not want to purchase all of this equipment for a one-time cake, many bakers will do the hard work for you. Call your local bakeries to see if they can print an edible image for you. Method 2, Plastic Wrap Slash Laminate Not everyone wants to go out and purchase special equipment to put a picture onto a cake. And that's okay. If you want to use a physical photo or print a digital image using regular paper and ink, you can still use it. Obviously, you won't want to put the picture directly onto the cake, and people should not consume it. Not only will the photo not taste very good, but it can be toxic. What can you do? You have two choices. Wrap the photo tightly with plastic wrap. The plastic wrap will protect the image from being overrun with delicious frosting. Laminate the photo. You can be extra safe by having the photo laminated before placing it on top of your cake. Either way, you can place the photo directly onto the cake. Be gentle. As you do not want the picture to penetrate the icing. When it's time to consume the cake, remove the photo and enjoy it as usual. Method 3, Trace the photo. If you want to test your creativity, you can always trace the image instead of using wax paper and a photo. Using this method, it's best to keep the image more uncomplicated with minor detail. Otherwise, the details can get lost in translation. Here's how to do it. Step 1, place a sheet of wax paper over the image. Step 2, trace the image. Step 3, flip the wax paper over, so the ink is facing down. Step 4, use icing to create the image. It's best to work from the top and move downward. Step 5, when you're done, flip the image over and press the frosting side down into the cake. Step 6, at this point, you can perform any necessary touch-ups until you're happy with your cake. Serve and enjoy.